get you a little closer to those targets in the light over there. Go cover to cover until you reach the luggage stand. Make it there, and I might be able to help you out. I don't like being out here with no freaking backup. Put the guys on, huh? You think I'm that? there. Hang on. I'm yeah. tapping into the city's power get grid. Some That'll let me overload the transformers near you and blow out those lights. Yeah. Hey there, kiddo. What's wrong? I don't like the dark. It's scary. Turn on the light for me, please. Come on, sweetie. There's nothing to be afraid of in the dark. Sometimes darkness is a good thing. Like when you want to go to sleep. I could go to sleep with the light on. When it's light, you can't see into a place that's dark. But when it's dark, you can see what's around you much better. Really? Really. So if there's monsters or bad people around, you can see them. And if you're in the dark, they can't see you. I can't see you either. Can you please turn the light back on? Okay. Then how about this? There's one really cool thing I didn't show you yet. There is? Show me. Okay, here it is. When you're in the dark and your eyes get used to it, you can see all sorts of things around you really well. And then you can do stuff with them. Like what? Now take a look at your mobile. You can see it really well, right? If there were monsters standing underneath it, because I can see it, maybe I could make it fall on them and they'd go away. And it would fall on their heads and they wouldn't be bad anymore? That's my girl. Daddy, what was that? Daddy needs you to stay in bed now, okay? He's going to shut the door and I'll be back real soon, all right? Okay, Daddy, I love you. Stay in bed. There you go, Sam. Nice and dark, just the way you like it. Whoever did this is dead. I'm waiting for you, shithead. Oh. Come out and show yourself, fuckface. Is that it, Fisher? You're running away? What do you got, man? You got anything good? This place is shit. Hey, you picked it, asshole. You said we'd get a couple of thou easy. I heard there was metals and shit we could fence in here. And the lady that lives here is hot. Maybe we could wait for her to come home. Take it out and trade. Now shit. you're talking. Don't check out on me. Graham. Oh, there you are. They brought in some reinforcements, and the man calling the shots is with them. Get a hold of him. I'll ID him, and you can figure out what questions to ask. Now, uh, who's paying the bill at this point? Hoban. Oh, man, why we gotta keep working for this guy? I've got an ID on the leader, Sam. His name is Dimitri Gramko, a so local street-level boss. He hires himself and his gang out on a regular basis. Who's he working for now? Why don't you ask him? I think I will. Cover me, you ass! Oh, oh shit! Oh. Don't you gotta kill him! Good dude! Get you to walk out of here alive! You gotta hear fuck! Get you to walk out of here alive! You got it! That's it, asshole! Why look at you? Let You're dead meat! You think you're sick, Fisher, you hear me? I'm fucking with the Galaxy Fisher. Uh, I'm out of here. Keep Looking for me, asshole. 
No more playing around. Who sent you? Fuck you! Okay, enough. You want to know, send me. It's Colbin. Andre Colbin. <coughs> Runs drugs, guns. Anything people want, he gets it for them. Not good enough. Why does Coben want me dead? If I talk, he'll kill me. Oh, oh you see nothing matter, I swear. He, he drove the car that hit your daughter. Used to brag about it, you know? Uh, heard you were coming, so he hired me to, to kill you before you killed him. You should refund his money. Where do I find him? In the city, the old museum on King George Street. It's his place now. Guards out front and on the sides. Don't tell him I told you. Oh, I'm not gonna tell him a damn thing. Consider this a teaching moment. Hey, 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 hey. Is this thing on? And you? It is. You take the Good. Look. I don't know how you, you got this far, but you're not going to get any further. Be careful. You Watch your face. Well, you found me. We've we got to find him first. Push him out and take him down. Do you hear me? You know why not?
I'll go check on that. Look at shit! You'll die in the That son of a bitch is gonna come through that door and we're gonna blast him when he does! Boss, what if he comes through the window? Then you shoot him! What kind of fucking stupid question is that? You get this straight. Nobody is going anywhere until Fisher is dead. Until he shows up, all you gotta do is shut up and get ready to shoot. Are we clear? Yeah, boss. I said shut up! Easy there, boss. Don't tell me to take it easy. I'm ready. Are you idiots ready? I'm ready. I'm ready right now. <laughs> I'm not hearing anything. Are you hearing anything? Shit! You, uh, Danton. Go check it out. See what's going on behind that door. Boss, I don't see anything. Oh. What are you waiting for? Fucking kill him! <laughs> Who <laughs> you, Fisher? Oh, that's going to mark. There he is, the red house! This is my house, you hear me? My house! Give it up, Fisher! Why don't you just goddamn die? Andre Coben, were you saying something about my daughter? Oh, God, no. I was just messing with you, man. I didn't mean it. I swear I didn't mean it. Then make it up to me. Tell me why you killed her. I can't tell you. All you can do is kill me. It was just a job. They just gave me a picture and told me to provide a body. That's all it was, a dump job. They isn't good enough. Who were you working for? I can't tell you. I'm still working for them. They'll gut me if I tell you. They're not the ones you should be worried about right now. You don't get it, Fisher! They're bigger than you. They're bigger than me! Don't you see? They told me you were coming! Drop it, Fisher! Move away! Don't you won't be hurt! Sam, Sam God damn it, need to go with them. The hell I do. Trust me on this one. If you're talking to the Ice Queen, Fisher, I'd advise you to listen. She knows all sorts of things you'd be interested in. What took you so fucking long? Don't move! Hands in the air! Fisher, nice and easy! Man, this is Ghost Hawk 1. We've secured Panther and are ready to return to base. All right, Grim. You get this one. But if it's a setup... Son of a... Something about an op in Indonesia. You don't know half of it. Fuck! Grim, I've got the package. Good. Now here's the plan. They may not be able to track my car by GPS, but what? they've got a chopper on site. That means they don't need to. They'll just blow me off the road. We're far enough out into the sticks that no one will notice. You need to disable that chopper, or you're not going anywhere. Roger. Ah! It would be better to hold off on the detonation. Think it's really gonna work? I don't know. I don't want to climb this thing and find out the hard way that 
did it. It's not gonna dry quick enough. It's better. Oh! We're field testing stuff sooner than I'd like. Better keep playing on, man. When do you think we'll be done? Soon. That's what you always say. <gasps> I think I see him! Escape this, Fisher! Come on, show me what you got! The airfield isn't that big! We'll find you! Attention all personnel, the mess hall is now closed until further notice. parked just outside the gate off the main lot, but as things stand, you won't get far. What haven't you told me? There's a satellite dish on site with an uplink to a private spy bird. Use some C4 to take it out. I thought your car was clean. It is, but if they get a visual lock on you from the sat, it won't matter. Why don't you go see if there's anything else you forgot to mention? Search the 
Dish is taken care of. Then let's get you out of here. My car is outside. Attention, attention, all personnel. There is an escaped prisoner inside the compound. He is to be considered armed and dangerous. Well done. Report to your security position you immediately. Harder. You were clear to use deadly force. Sarah's fine, but I have to push back the call I promised you. Stop playing games, and don't call me again unless you've got my daughter on the line.
أمسكتك يا غبي هيا نذهب ونخبض عليه يا إلهي أهب وعموه وخعبه هيا بنا الآن إنه هنا أتعتقد أن هذا الأمر مضحك سأعطيك شيئا تضحك عليه حقا هل تعتقد أنه أغبياء تعال هل يراه هناك من أعلى سوف تموت ارمي قنبلة كم من الوقت ستبقى مختبئا؟ لكنها لن تفيدك خذ هذا ايها الوقت Thank me till we're out of here. When's backup coming? Good question. Wofford Base. This is Husky. I got two for a ride out of here. Husky, this is Wofford Base. You are one lucky son of a bitch. We'll have a bird in the air as soon as we can pinpoint your location. Roger that, Wofford. We are at... We gotta move! secret that we know each other, Vic. They're watching you, hoping to catch me. I think I'm insulted. You better take him out quietly so we can talk There's before no way they get back. Him the what else is now? It's okay, baby. Don't make a scene. It's not much money. If they spot you or the crowd does, the meat is off. Too much heat. Sure. Now get to it. Wow. Yeah. Hurry up, folks! It's the last ride of the night! It's your last chance to see the entire city before... Remember, people, Cox is the target. It is just the bait. Wait for him to meet us to Fisher, then let me know, and we'll back up down here so fast it'll make your head spin. Got it? Good. Why are you following me? 
I wasn't! I wasn't following you! I swear! Talk to me about Victor Cost. He's just this guy! I swear! I, I don't know anything else! Fisher, don't hurt me. I don't know anything. To see what it holds. Step inside. Tell me about your plans for me and your cost. Oh, fuck, Fisher. I was supposed to call it in when we saw you. Backup's waiting. Ready to take you in. Time for a change of plans, then. Got like no. ten thousand stuffed animals back there. Give me one more shot. Your manager will be all units. My zone is back. Got a minute to talk. Oh shit! You're fishing, are you? Shit! Why are you following Victor Cost? Cost was just bait of an associate. We were waiting for you. Told the call in when we saw you. Vic, I've taken care of your admirers. Then we got a window before the handlers figure out they're done and sent friends. If we're gonna do the face-to-face -face thing, we gotta do it now. You know the area around the monument? Yeah. There's a standalone booth right in front. Meet me there, I'll let you in. There you are. Here, put this on. We don't have a lot of time. Those spotters had to have backup. So we'll go over the basics here, cover the rest by phone. Sounds good. Look in the bag, you'll find your favorite pistol. I didn't get you anything. Shut up, Sam, there's no time. You'll also find something I borrowed from a buddy over at DARPA. It's a portable EMP generator. Low intensity, short range. It's bag shielded so you can stash your gear in there, but uh, hit the trigger, you'll fry everything around you to use as juice. Nice. What else do you have for me? Uh, there's a file in the bag, but here's the short version. There's an R&D house called White Box, a DOD contractor that does work on EMP technology. So? So, six months ago, they suddenly contract out all their security to those assholes over at Black Arrow. Now, that's a breaking pattern for them. They don't do corporate security. And based on what you told me about them... There might be a connection. Bingo. It's slim, but you've gone fifth freedom based on less. All right, time for you to go. And you ping me when you reach safe distance, and we'll talk more about White Box before you go in. Will do. Stay safe, Vic. By order of the Department of <laughs> Public Works, this fair and the museum are now closed. We have detected a gas leak on site. Everybody is to leave the fairground in an orderly fashion immediately. Attention, attention. There's a gas leak on the site. For your safety, we need you to proceed to your cars in an orderly fashion immediately. Repeat, this is for your safety. Whoa, what the? Might as 
Well, come out! I know you're here somewhere! for making my job easier. You got away with it at our airfield, Fisher, but now it's over! So, Vic, how do I get in this box? Look for an industrial air exchanger on the side of the building. Breach it, then go for their security monitoring setup downstairs. Your next objective should be easy to pick out once you've accessed the camera feeds. Famous last words.
Please don't kill me. Don't kill me. Answer my questions and we'll see. What are you working on that requires this kind of lockdown? Electromagnetic pulse countermeasure stuff for DARPA, mostly. Or we were. Since Robertson got here, it's been all project driven. Robertson? What's his deal? You mean besides letting Black Arrow take over the lab? He collects all the experimental data and wipes it off the rest of the systems bad for workflow, and only he can see the big picture of what mm. we're working on. What about Lucius Galliard? Where does he fit in? <laughs> He's my boss, the owner of the company, and the guy who hired Black Arrow and Robertson to do security. I'm thinking it might be a good idea to relieve Robertson of that data. Can you get me in? I could get you into the elevator. Good. Do it, then get out. I think I'd rather stay. Some of my friends... They might need my help. Maybe I can... Good luck. Colonel Francis wants to screen an 
I know you're inside White Box. I can help. Just let me know when you reach Robertson's system. So you heard everything. What a surprise. But now you're supposed to have good news about Sarah. She's on the line. That's why I called. Make it quick. Dad? Sarah, is it you? Are you okay? They told me you were dead, Dad. They told me that you'd been killed. They told me the same thing about you. I... I... Sorry, Sam. Time's up. Graham. Later. You've got work to do. That's him right over there! I got you in there! There he is, I see him! Yeah, you better hide from me! Go in, I'll cover you! Keep him busy, I'm going in! Oh, shit! You're pushing me! Hiding like a little bitch! 
busting back up at my location. We need to sweep the area. I got it, Fisher! Ah! I knew you'd show up, Fisher! I can see Robertson's system from here. Talk to me, Grim. Good. Now think about making this room a hostile environment for uninvited guests. I might need you to be on that system for a while, and I don't want you interrupted. Remote detonation mines should do the trick. Sam here. I'm looking at Robertson's system. Perfect. Can you get me a back door? Just like old times. You've got root access and a socket address. Thanks. I'm setting up a capture so I can download everything he's got. All of the EMP data is on there. A couple of analysts I trust are looking forward to seeing it. Okay, Sam. The link is active, and the pipe is full. So I'm done here. Not quite. I need you to babysit this from your end. If the connection goes, I can't re-establish it from here. So, nobody else gets their hands on this box. From what I'm seeing, that system could be used to shut down the site's connectivity. I'd be locked out, and we'd be out of luck. Then I'd better get ready. Company's coming. Just hit 60%. the same. Someone's locked a trace onto my download. I can't cut it. And if they find me, my cover's blown and so is Sarah's. Where's it coming from? Looks like inside white box. First floor. Blueprints show a large space. Probably a test lab. Right, I went through it. They store their test EMP there. You might have to use it. Do whatever it takes, but cut that trace. Vic, I'm inside White Box and I need a hand.
You better be! Hold it! The area's compromised. Looks like an ambush. Drop your weapon and surrender! Now! Lucius Galliard? You know him? Not directly, but let me get back to you on this. Don't go after him until I do. In the meantime, we'll have an analyst working on Robertson's data. I'm inside. What now? The President's on the line, Sam. We need to eavesdrop on the conversation Reed's about to have with Galliard. Uh -huh. So bug the memorial. We thought of that, Mr. Fisher. Galliard's people scrubbed the site in preparation for my vice president's charming little speech. And there was no time to get new equipment in place. Then what's plan B? You are. This morning's camera equipment is still in place. Get to the control booth, hack the camera controls to record oh. the conversation, and uplink yeah. the feed to us. Just like that. All right, I'm on it. Of what? Speech? Yeah, I thought it was pretty good. Did you vote for it? In the primaries? No. I'm a little surprised the administration. All right, Grim. I'm in the camera booth. Now what? You need to sync the feed from the console to me so that I can see what we're getting. It should be easy to hack. Hang on. That's it. Now I need you to get comfortable with those camera controls. We're dealing with directional mics here, high-end, but they're integrated with the camera focus. Get Reed and Galliard in the shot, and we'll get the audio. Miss them, and we get nothing. And here they come... now.
Lucius, I'm glad you can make it. We've got some last-minute logistic issues to discuss. We're 24 hours out, and you want to talk paperclip requisitions here, now. The site's clean, and I knew you'd be here since your company did the setup on the Samson speech. One of my companies, yes. I have several. <laughs> which includes Black Arrow, which I assume is what you want to talk about. We can talk about Black Arrow's shortcomings later. I want to talk about what I need to make this go off smoothly. Oh. Do you now? I was... said that. What did you think of Samson's speech? It was a nice piece of grandstanding. He should give his right... He swears he writes all his speeches himself. I'm sure it plays well for the folks back home. I don't like the chances. You don't like Samson. I don't trust Samson. But... This is what your people want. The people I represent want you to deal with Fisher. Stop wasting time. Stop wasting their money. If Megiddo's getting cold feet... Let me make this clear, Reed. Megiddo planned this operation. Megiddo paid for this operation. And Megiddo would be very upset if anyone were allowed to interfere with it. He's not going to interfere because my men will deal with them, since Black Arrow wasn't able to. I'll worry about Black Arrow. You stick to the plan. Is this place to meet, of all places. And why would you say that? The eyes of history are upon it. Pardon things out of the history books, thank you. Really? I thought you enjoyed the spotlight more than that. I'll do the song and dance when I have to, but the man on stage is the one. The cover's important, especially at a time like which would explain why you're still here. Executive oversight. I hate leaving things to chance or third party. You're supposed to be in Paris. All hell's about to break loose. My men will be very busy. So I cannot guarantee your safety. I'm not asking you to. Are you sure? This is to protect you and the operation. Some things require a personal touch. Now, if that's everything, we're done here. I'll see you when it's over. Goodbye, Lucius. Let's go after Reed. No, the smart play is to talk to Galliard. We can find Reed later. I concur. I want to know more about Megiddo, and Lucius Galliard is the only source we have. Okay, go. I'll freeze Galliard in place. What? Galliard. Mr. Galliard. My name is Anna Grimm's daughter. I'm calling on behalf of Tom Reed at 3rd Echelon. I know who you are. I just finished talking with your boss. What does Reed want now? Director Reed felt that the resolution... You really shouldn't talk to Grimm like that. Guards! Where the hell are my guards? It's just you and me, Lucius. Let's talk. What's your connection with Reed? If you ask nicely, I tell you. He's just hired help. God, you're thick. This is bigger than Reed, bigger than Third Echelon. They're, they're just convenient. So why does Reed want you out of town? Ugh. Your enhanced interrogation techniques need work. He wants to run the show when the EMPs are triggered. There's three of them, scattered around the city. In a few hours, they go off, and he gets to play commando. There are people he wants to impress. <laughs> the EMPs, where do I find them? Say please. I don't know. That's part of the plan, you see? You can't stop it, Fisher. It's too big. It's too late. And the people I work for, this is just part of what they've got going on.
Megiddo. Who are they? Try harder, Fisher. Megiddo. Who are they? They're the ones who run this town. In Moscow, in Beijing, in any other place in Madison. <laughs> They're the ones who are going to get me out of this in one piece. And once Reed is finished at the white... <laughs> That's all Reed now. Damn it. Officer in trouble! Sam, what's happening? Galliard's dead. The shooter's running. We need him alive. He may be our only link between Third Echelon and Megiddo. I've got a visual. He's on the stage. No harm done. He just Boy, ducked into the VIP line. tent. Go, Sam. You have to catch him. On the move again, Sam. Third Echelon squads converging on your position right now. What about the cops? Third Echelon called them off. <laughs> the gloves are off. I need a ride out of here. The Secret Service agent who brought you in is on his way to extract you. But until he gets there, you're on your own. Target spot! <laughs> Flash grenade! Sam, a second wave of operatives is on its way.
Do not have a visual on Fisher. Check on the first floor! <laughs> Get a move on, Sam. My contact on the inside just sent me a text. Security's looking for him. He's a techie named Charlie Fryman. And before you ask, yes, I trust you. Well, that's good enough for me. Where is he? Near the server room. Get to him before security does, or he won't be able to help you. Attention all personnel, please remember to keep your key card with you at all times. Without your key card, you will not be able to access the building and may be detained until proof of your identity can be provided. Thank you. For Sam. One thing Third Echelon had always been about was the truth. Even after everything that happened, he'd held on to that. But now he was coming back as the hunter. As the enemy. As the one thing he'd never thought he'd be. And the truth... It was waiting for him.
I'm sorry. We're closing the office early for some routine maintenance. Please try again tomorrow. Thank you. I'm sorry, sir, but I'm afraid the office is closed for the evening. I'm here to see Tom Reed. Mr. Reed is currently unavailable. But if you'd like to make an appointment, Mr. Fisher, I used to work here. Security alert. Main power is offline. Emergency power will be online in five, four, three, two, one, zero. Security doors are closing. Over here! Are you Fryman? Yeah. Yeah. You're Fisher, right? Anna told me that you were coming. I, I was a big fan of yours back when you worked here. I was a big fan. I'm touched. What do you have for me? I've got those. Ultra high frequency sonar goggles. Better than the stuff the new splinter cells are getting. Hey, try them on. Voila. With these babies, you can see in the dark, you can see through walls, you name it. It's not bad. Plus, I tweak them so that you can see the security system laser grid. Trip the beam, and a turret targets the brick. Nasty stuff. I programmed the algorithm. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> oh, but just one thing. Um, the top of the line guys are, are packing similar gear, so if you can see them, they, they might be able to see you. Thanks. Now you better get moving. Oh, I'll be fine. I'll just tell the security guards that I was reading in the can. You know, they'll walk me right back to my office. And you, on the other hand, is... Good luck. Fisher could be in the server room. I want everybody there. 
ASAP. Nothing yet. Can anyone see the target? No pass along those balconies. Engage in contact. No visual. God damn it! Oh. Open. Logan, Reed, this was part of the deal. Protection. Well, protect me. I'm telling you, he's here. You need to. Nice to see you again. Look, Fisher, I can explain. Nobody's coming to save you this time, Henri. Now tell me, what the hell is Reed up to? Reed's working with Megiddo. He's using Third Echelon to get EMPs into the country. And sighted in DC, I, I helped set it up, it's what I do. Why? What does Reed get out of this? The president, they're gonna take out the president after the EMPs go up. Paralyze the city, use it as cover for the hit. 
tonight. Why go after the president? I can't tell you. She won't play ball, but the VP is already in Mugito's pocket. Reed gets a medal and a big fat promotion after it all goes down. That son of a bitch. Last question. This is the important one. What do you know about my daughter? If I tell you, you're gonna kill me! I don't know anything about her! Fisher! Like I said, they gave me a picture. Told me to provide a body that matched. I did a lot of jobs like that for Third Echelon. Anything they needed. Ask your friend Grimm's daughter. I worked with her a bunch of times. She knows more about this than I do! Shut up. Still alive? Good. I think. I just had an interesting discussion with your friend Coben. Reed's in bed with Megiddo. They're going after the president and playing Kingmaker with a VP. The EMPs are for cover. Of course. Aid won't be able to get there in the aftermath, and they'll have a convenient terrorist attack as cover for everything. Coben had a few other things to say. I'm headed to your office, Grim. What am I gonna find there? Something long overdue. Patch me through in telepresence when you get there. We'll talk then. We're clean here. Did anyone check the restricted areas? We're clean here. Fisher's still in our building and it's on the loose. I repeat, Fisher is on the loose. If you're on the plane, then I can feel it. No visual on the contact. Does anyone have a fix on it? Thank <laughs> you. 
Attention all personnel. Protocol 2319 is now in effect. Site cleanup and data sterilization has begun. All personnel must reach minimum safe distance of 100 yards from the building immediately. Sam, read launch protocol 2319. Get out of there, now. Warning, protocol 2319 is now in effect. Tell me what I need to know, and I might not snap your neck. Fuck you. I'm not afraid of you, Fisher. Wrong answer. That's a weaponized EMP over there. How do I shut it down? No, don't know. And even if I did, I wouldn't tell you, asshole. Funny. Now, tell me what I need to know. Anything else? Oh, I swear. Stop wasting my time. If you don't know, who does? Oh, scientist! Brought over by Prentiss! Inside the warehouse! Gonna be disposed of after the EMP goes off. She knows. You don't say. Position. We'll wait for him here. 
The area is compromised. Right. Semi, put it away for him right here. Sense. If he's here, he wants to deactivate Big Boy over the hammock. The best way to deactivate it is to come through here. So, we'll be seeing Fisher Everyone soon enough. I don't know who you are, or what you're doing here, but thank you. They were going to- Save it. There's a weaponized EMP slung up a hundred yards from here. It's going to be activated tonight. Tell me how to stop you it. You can't. There's two generators on site. When they're activated, they'll juice the EMP, and then it'll discharge. What's the catch? If you take out one generator, the other one automatically flashes. Each of them alone is enough to trigger the pulse. So I need to hit both at the same time. Yes. Or else it goes off. Are you with a friend? Otherwise, there's no way. There's always a way. Now, you better go. Things are going to get ugly around here. It's going to get ugly everywhere. Report. Gun! Oh, oh, oh. 
You won't pass this Don't let the fish get through the doors! Nothing here. There's too much Screw cover for it. Too many places sure. to hide. Looks like trouble. We're gonna hold here. That's over, Fisher. Ah, Not shit. this time. No signs of Fisher. Rest Tell the other sites that the reservoir is still good to here. go. Everybody stay sharp. See the target? Sound off. Whoa! Oh, shit. I got a possible Man. fix. Die, Gusher! Die! Die! Move! Go! Go! You Fisher, damn it! Got him surrounded! Hold that to the hook! Damn it! Vic, I've got bad news. And water remains wet. What do you got? There are two generators powering the EMP. I need to take both out simultaneously, and I'm all out of C4. Mark the GPS coordinates for me. I'll see what I can do when I get there. Roger that. Sam Fisher is somewhere around here. As far as... I don't... Huh. God oh. damn it! Motherfucker! Oh. 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 I got 
signs of a possible ambush. Get ahead. Holding position.
Sometimes you just have to do things the hard way. Call the army to deal with this shit. They gotta call the National Guard. They already did, man. Saw this whole line of Humvees heading into the city. Guys 13, in black body armor 14, were getting out, setting 15, up checkpoints. Go! That ain't the guard, man. That's the Not black arrow. Not working. We need the G-Fib. Some private you don't have the goddamn G-Fib. You don't have anything. As soon as they get the phones pressure. working again, we'll call your parents and make sure they're all right. Not all right. We don't even know what's happening. Sorry, man. Ah! My wife is in the car. I've got to get her out. There's nothing you can do for her, okay? She's dead. You're going to get yourself killed. No. I'm not. We're going to fight. Let's have a good fight. DC. Damn it! Come on, let's find this hostile and shut him down. Send reinforcements ASAP! I'm gonna stand watch here. Do no visual on the target. You guys keep going. I'll stay here and stand guard. Holy cow! Gotta get this asshole! No sign of him yet.
chick. What's her name? Brimstone. Mother! <laughs> Team bagging the primary objective. How if I know? Holy! I guess all the training paid off. Sam, we have an opportunity here. We have stashed Vice President Samson in the ballroom with personal bodyguards. He's waiting to be introduced as the next president. That's on my route to the West Wing. Pay him a visit. 
Then meet me in the press room. We'll figure out how to tackle Reed there. Two kills confirmed. No survivors. You were quick for strength. No I don't have a fix on the target. The target's still nearby. Let's find it. Looks like trouble. Everybody watch your stick! Come on! Mother! Whoa. Whoa. I think I got him! He's over there! Check. Right. Contact is still in the area. Continue searching until you find him. Hang tight, I'm on the way. Grenade! No visual on the contact. I've got Overwatch. Engage the target. Go side of the target. He's gone. Can't engage, no visual. We got the target, I'll keep you covered. I'm closing, get down! We got the I've got no visual on the hostile. I don't have a fix on the target. Everyone hold up and wait for the contact. Area is compromised. Hold position. Oh, done. Do you? You can't touch me. I got protection. I'm Teflon. So whatever you think you're gonna do to me, Mr. Has been. Oh, Mr. Rogue Agent. Oh, it's your washed up spy. Well, you can forget about it right now, because I'm bulletproof. Goddamn bulletproof, you hear? Oh, really? You know, you need to work on that whole Son bulletproof thing. Bitch! Oh, God, it hurts!
Everyone hold position. Oh. Why are you laughing when I put my foot up your ass? The area head looks compromised. I'm holding position. You're not getting through here. We're out of time, Sam. Where are you? I'm close. Get closer. Reed's knocking on the door to the Oval Office right now. Whatever it's worth, Sam, I am so sorry for everything. I thought we were in a hurry. Right. We need to get you close to Reed, and we need to do it in a way that doesn't make him double-tap the President immediately. Got any ideas? One. But it's gonna hurt. Just do what you have to do. I always do, Sam. I always do. <laughs> Tom? I've got Fisher. I'm bringing him in. Don't do anything drastic until I get there. Sorry, Sam. You're going to the Oval Office. You've got to dress properly for the occasion. Hands? You comfortable? Ah, fuck. Get up. <clears throat> You've got an appointment with the President. All those years, you were lying to me. It was for the greater good, Sam. And I would do it again in a heartbeat, for the same reasons. Guess I never did know you. No, you didn't. And you still don't. I was wondering when you were gonna get here. Nice work, Anna. I see you got some payback in for the stun he pulled at the airfield. Well, he put up a little bit of a fight. <laughs> of course he did. And now he's here, the famous Sam Fisher, just in time to be useful. So how does it feel, Sam, knowing you're gonna go down in history as the man who assassinated President Caldwell? Fuck you, Reed. Of course, we'll be just a little too late to rescue her. And you'll be shot multiple times trying to escape. It's classic, but it's clean. You don't honestly believe that this is gonna work. The surveillance camera's footage is gonna show. Your cameras, we own them. Your security measures, we made sure the Pulse fried them. We're third echelon, Madam President. We own every bit of information that goes through this town. And if I want to, I can make it look like you were assassinated by two circus clowns and a golden retriever. So shut up, and you might live a few seconds longer. Huh, that's not third echelon. It's not Lambert's third echelon. Last time I checked, he was dead. And guess what? Third Echelon nearly died with Tom. Him. You see, the president decided the agency wasn't justifying its funding anymore. She was gonna shut us down, leave America vulnerable to the sort of attacks. Madam President, are you all right? Yes, I'm oh, fine, thank you. Son of a... Uh... That was a close You've got call. maybe two minutes before the army takes back the White House. Make them useful. How did Megiddo get to you? You don't want to know about Megiddo. You want to know about your daughter. You don't get to talk about my daughter. You still don't get it, do you? Sarah didn't matter. Threatening her was just a way to get to you. 
And leveraging you was a way to get to third echelon. And third echelon, that was a way to get what they wanted out of the White House. You're the mole. You're the one Lambert was worried about. Very good, Sam. You finally see. You son of a bitch! You cost me three years of my life. Three years when I thought my daughter was dead. Move! Move! Drop your weapon on the floor now! Captain, thank you for rescuing me. Now, I don't see anyone else here but us, and I'm sure you don't either. Oh, ma'am. Let's get you out of here. Thank you. Oval Office is secure. We have the President. POTUS is safe and secure. I've talked to Sam once since he left. He told me that he and Sarah were gonna take some time to catch up. He talked about learning who was really important to you, while you always had to come back for him. He talked about family. And you know what the last thing he said to me was just before he hung up? Vicky said, Thanks for everything. I love you like a brother. Brother? That's family, right? Yeah. I thought so.